My name is Irene Marr and I live in Hamilton. It was the regular breast screening um, that um, they discovered that I had breast cancer in the right breast. Um, I had the, the breast removed and it wasn't until some time after that I found that my sleeves were very tight, went to the doctor and they discovered I had lymphedema. My name is Betty Clark and I live in Glasgow. They have a programme whereas when you turn 50 you go for breast screening and I went for the breast screening and I got word back two weeks later that something had shown up on the breast screening and when I went back I was told they were 70% sure I had breast cancer. The reason that I have the lymphedema, I was told that they'd taken about at least 11 lymph nodes to test it to see if the cancer had spread, which it had spread to at least three lymph nodes. And later on, I didn't realise that I think I was kind of protecting my arm quite a lot. And my sister-in-law had said to the doctor, and then they'd mentioned lymphedema. So I think it was because they'd taken so many lymph nodes away that this can cause the lymphedema. I've been living with lymphedema for 16 years. It doesn't really have a great impact in my life because I wear the sleeve to keep the arm down. It keeps it under control. The only difficult part is sometimes getting garments to fit you because the one arm is much bigger than the other. But you can get around that by wearing things that stretch. Um, it only causes me discomfort the week before I go into the clinic to have it bandaged because by then it's slightly swollen and the sleeve is quite tight. Throughout the day, I don't really notice it's there. It doesn't hamper me in any way at all. It just becomes probably part of you. You go to a special lymphedema clinic at least twice a year and if the nurse thinks everything's fine, she'll say to me, well, maybe not have to see you for maybe another six months, but if there's any problems, you've got their phone number and just call them and I can come back any time. I've been given like exercises that I can do and to wear the sleeve every day and that stops it from swelling up. And if I'm doing any gardening or anything, you're supposed to wear gardening gloves because you're quite prone to infection. If, you, if that hand or arm gets cut, also you have to wear it because if you take hell in the street and you're unconscious, you're not supposed to get like your blood pressure taken or te um, excuse me, blood tests. You've always to tell them to take it in the good arm. Even though I wear this garment all the time, it doesn't really remind me of cancer because after 16 years, you're used to it. If I'm going out, I mean, all my friends know that I've got lymphedema. I sometimes, because the garment is showing, I put sequins on it or maybe a brooch or something just to add a bit of glamour. It doesn't have too much impact on my life as long as I wear the sleeve and do as I've been instructed. And if I'm going out and a night out, I can take the sleeve off. So, you know, got kind of self-conscious about wearing it. It doesn't have an emotional effect on me having lymphedema. Um, it's just like putting on your shoes every morning. You know, you put the sleeve on, getting dressed, and it's, it's just part, part of me now after 16 years. And I'm very grateful that they can keep it under control at the lymphedema clinic. For information, help, or if you just want to chat, call the Macmillan support line on 0808 808 0000 or visit macmillan.org.uk.